Hey everyone, welcome back to Magic Time. Hope you can hear me. I'm uh, right next to Highway 12, pretty loud out here in Carneros, where I am at the Hyde Vineyard, one of the country's best Chardonnay and Pinot Noir vineyards. Uh, here to do a little wine tasting in the vineyard of uh, some Hyde Chardonnay. Enjoy. I love tasting wine in the vineyard. I love being in the vineyard. I'm in one of America's best Chardonnay vineyards right now uh, on the, the Hyde property. Um, Larry Hyde is an iconic grape grower. Uh, started growing grapes here in 1979 with the first 100 acres that he planted. Subsequently, the family has grown their land holdings and have about 300 acres um, just over 200 of that is planted to vine. They grow Chardonnay, Pinot Noir, Cabernet Franc, Cabernet Sauvignon, although a very small amount of that. Um, Merlot, Syrah, Viognier, the tiniest bit of Semillon, and they grow Sauvignon Blanc as well. Hope I'm not leaving any grape varieties out. But, uh, it's a world-renowned vineyard for its Chardonnay and its Pinot, but mostly the Chardonnay. And uh, there's, a, there's a lot of beautiful wineries that have worked with Larry Hyde over the last 45 years. Um, really well-known producers such as Kistler, Paul Hobbs, uh, David Ramey, John Kongsgaard, um, Duckhorn, Farniente, all types of uh, amazing producers, Spotswood, um, that have purchased grapes from the Hyde family over the years. And it's a vineyard property that's renowned for its consistency and quality, uh, as Larry Hyde is always searching for improvements in his vineyard. Um, and he does so with the help of his son, Chris. Um, really beautiful people. Um, I'm fortunate enough to know them and uh, do some work for them. But um, great family, the Hydes. I'm sitting in a fairly old block. I don't know the whole history of this block. If the hides were here, they'd probably uh, tell me a little bit more about it, but it's definitely old vines. Um, probably some of the first that were planted on the property. Um, I'm here to taste the Kistler 2020 Hyde Vineyard Chardonnay. Lucky enough to uh, go visit the Kistler property yesterday. And of course, tasted through a lot of their portfolio. Beautiful Chardonnay is all around, but the one that stood out to me the most was the Hyde vineyard shard um, 2020 great vintage in Carneros um, in particular nice beautiful cool vintage um, produced Chardonnays of exceptional quality and very good acidity um, the color on the Kistler is a beautiful golden color um, actually it's you know it's, a, it's kind of a light golden color not too deep the nose is brimming. I mean, it is exploding from the glass. Gorgeous notes of pineapple, lemon curd, pear, pineapple upside down cake. Really pretty nose. Very expressive. The most subtle bit of like a reductive note, which uh, you find in a lot of the top burgundies of the world. Um, but uh, not intrusive at all, just really, really pretty. Almost gives it like this kind of minerality type tone to the wine. A little bit of like a lemon pith. Beautiful. Um, baked apple, baked uh, kind of Granny Smith apple. As typical with Chardonnay from the Hyde Vineyard, this wine has full intensity, loads of acidity, big uplift on the palate, very bright, very densely packed with a lot of flavor. Um, this wine is not over oaked at all, just a kiss of oak. I think they use like 30% new oak when they make the wine at Kistler. Um, exceptional balance, super long finish, loads of that, uh, those flavor profiles that I was talking about, that lemon curd, lemon pith, 
Um, there's some tropical notes on it, some pineapple notes, pear, um, like a very ripe pear. Beautiful, beautiful Chardonnay. If you can get your hands on it, which it's not so easy to get your hands on Kistler as it is, and especially the Hyde Vineyard, if you can get your hands on this bottle of wine, it's exceptional. One of the best Chardonnays I've had all year, if not all last five years. Really, really good Chardonnay. If I had to put a score on it up to 100, good Lord. I mean, it's a, it's high 90s, 98, 99 points, practically 100. It's a seamless wine. So, I mean, 100-point uh, scores or whatever, I certainly don't hold any weight in that category as a critic, but it's pretty perfect wine. So seek out Kistler. Seek out anything from the Hyde Vineyard if you can get your hands on it. Um, the wines are increasing in price as the reputation of the vineyard continues to, to explode. But, um, yeah, Hyde Chardonnay, find it. Find it from uh, David Ramey. Find it from Patson Hall. Um, the Hyde property that they uh, started in 2017, the winery, they have exceptional Chardonnay there that the Hydes actually own. Um, Kistler, of course, Paul Hobbs. Um, there's a number of other producers, too, that aren't coming to my mind. But the Hyde Vineyard, beautiful property. Um, Carnero Chardonnay. Check it out, baby. Cheers.